my name's Rachel and this is my daughter Tabitha and I'm here to show you how to home tutor today whilst the scores are off as well as looking after little children at the same time. So here you can see I've set up a small play area, um, got dinosaurs, play-doh, rice etc just to keep him occupied whilst I'm doing some um, work with Tabitha. Today we're going to do number bonds to ten. Um, we're going to start by using concrete materials and this is the doing stage where Tabitha can use different materials to find out answers. So you could use blocks, you could use Lego, you could use sweets. We're going to be using um, beads on pipe cleaner so we've got 10 beads here. So Tabitha, could you show me how to make 9 add 1 equals 10? Okay, so you've pushed 9 there and we've got 1 there, so 9 add 1 equals 10. Now could you show me what mm, 8 add 2, so double check you've got 8 there. And whilst you're doing that, I'm going to record those that number sentence on the no, piece of paper. Out. Pardon, Felix? It's not coming out. It's not coming out. Push no. it harder then. Put some more Play-Doh in. Okay, so we've got 8 add 2 here. Now, could you make 7 and... What would the other... 7 add 3. So, double check the 7 there. And I'm going to write it here. Now, here you can see I've got... 9 add 1 equals 10, 8 add 2 equals 10, 7 add 3 equals 10. What's happening to these numbers here? 9, 8, 7. They're getting smaller, aren't they? And what's happening to these numbers? 1, 2, 3. Okay, so what do you think might be the next number here? 9, 8, 7. 6. 6. So you make 6. 6 add. And what have you got when you... What have you got that sign? One, two, three, four. Mm, interesting. What do you think might happen next? Nine, eight, seven, six. Five. Five. Add one, two, three, four, five. You make five add five then. Five add five equals ten. Now, what will the next number be? Nine, eight, seven, six, five. Four. You make four. And what will happen to the other side? So what have you got? Four add... Eight. Two. Uh, uh, four add... You haven't got four yet, so make four. And how many have you got the other side? Four. Nine. Six. So four add six equals ten. Now look what's happened to this number, it's swapped over, hasn't it? 6 add 4 equals 10, 4 add 6 equals 10. So what do you think will happen to 7 add 3 equals 10? 3 add 7. 3 add 7 equals 10. And what do you think would happen to 8 add 2? It would be 2 add 8. 2 add 8 equals 10. And what would happen to 9 add 1 equals 10? It would be 1 add 9. Okay, should we double check the pattern, see if we're right? You help me count. 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. And on this side, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. So the numbers have swapped over after, after add 5. They, they swap over, don't they? Now... What we're going to do now, we're going to have a quick game with our number cards. So I'm going to put out these number cards. So we've got 5, 4, 7, 9, 8, 6, 5, 3, 2, 1. And what I want you to do is match up the, the numbers with their partner as quick as possible to make 10. Okay, ready, go. 9 and 1. Five add five. Hmm, what are we going to have next? Seven. Can you remember the partner of seven? Three. Good girl. Six and four and eight add two. Okay. 
Now, Tabitha, how could you remember nine and one if a partner? What could you think? Nine is the biggest one. And, and one is the smallest. Good girl. Mm, what about eight and two, though? How could you remember that one? Eight is the, is it the biggest number? It's the, it's the second biggest number, isn't it? And two is the second. Smallest. Yeah, okay. Now what you could do is keep doing that several times and time yourself each time, see if you can get faster. Now after the concrete stage, we're gonna move on to the pictorial stage. And this is the scene stage. So I want Tabitha to colour in three of these cubes here, okay, and see how many are left. So how many is left? Can you get closer? Seven. Seven, so write in the answer. And then, how, so we've got four, hello, yeah. So we need to colour in four and then find out how many are left. Can you make me an ice cream, please? Can you make me an ice cream? And how many are left? Six. So this one here, one adds what? And five, colouring five of those. Five adds something is ten. Okay, thank you. So here we've got the pictorial stage. Now when we've done that, we move on to the abstract stage, which is this it uses symbols and numbers. So Tabitha, I want you to fill in the missing numbers. So, four red, what is ten? Six. Yep. Seven add what is ten? Seven add ten. Eight add two is? Ten. Something add five is ten. Five. Nine add? Four. Is ten? Four add six. Is, is ten. And so she's completed her abstract stage. And what you could do is do these over several days. So do the concrete stage on Monday, the pictorial stage on Tuesday, and the abstract stage on Wednesday. And what I'll do today is just keep going over the number bonds with Tabitha throughout the day. So, if Tabitha, four add what is ten? Four add. Four add what is ten? Six. Six. Eight add what is ten? Eight add two. Nine add what is ten? Nine add one. And five add what is ten? Five add five. And I'll keep doing that and keep repeating it over the days until she's secure. Once your child is secure with your number bonds to 10, you can move on to your number bonds to 20. Thank you for listening to us. Bye-bye.